Hello, Internet! I'm Hamster Bomb, and you are back for some more Metal Gear Solid 4. And I'm kind of freaked out about this next area. Oh, gosh. We're finally heading towards Rex. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I don't know how far exactly we are. Um, we're in the blast furnace. I remember this room. Oh, my God. I remember how hard this was. You had to, like, go over here and, um... Sneak your way across that thing on the side. Oh, great. Those things are right here. I don't think we need the ration, do we? No, we don't. That is good. Gotta do this again. Oh, my gosh. Oh, those things are everywhere. Probably best to go the shortest route we can. Okay, and that shortest route... Is that where we're heading? This doesn't say, so... I think we should take it. These things are over there. They're below us. I can't just hop down. Where they are. Oh! I think that's where we gotta go. Okay. Let's try this. Stun grenades. Uh oh. Oh good, we found an L. Whatever. Whatever. Snake. Snake. I've got something Was to tell you about Naomi Hunter. Naomi Hunter. What about her? She might be a she spy. Be a spy. To, kill me. to kill me. Is that all you cared about? Frank Yeager. Frank Yeager. The man who you destroyed was my brother and my only family. Great Fox. You killed my benefactor and sent my brother home a cripple. I vowed revenge. But I can't go yet. I still have a job to do. I vowed revenge. Dang it, Naomi. This really is all because of her, isn't it? I mean, they. <gasps> They would never have gotten that far. There only appears to be this one on my radar, which means maybe if we just gun it this direction. Oh! Oh, it's coming, it's coming. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we? I'm just running into a room trying to get past it. Um. There's two exits, actually. One to the left and one to the right. According to the map, we're taking this one. Okay, so... Uh, I don't even know what's going on in this episode, really. I mean, we're just kind of running. Ration. Fortunately, we didn't need that. We actually have cleared this with no alerts so far. This is... We're good at this game, right? We're... Oh! Oh, they're everywhere! Oh, they're everywhere! Oh, they're... Wait a minute. Oh, great. Oh, how freaking lovely. Where are we going now? Um, oh, uh, there's a door in the far back, so we gotta go straight. Is he, ho he's hovering right on top of it, isn't he? And that's another one walking around, isn't it? Oh, gosh. And I don't even think this fools them. Oh, uh. Um, hey uh, guys, you got any more advice? I mean, I I know I've been, no. I know I've been, you know, spamming you for advice for a while, but um, please? The rolling facility is a long, narrow space that stretches south to north. Yes. The southern half houses the rollers, while the northern half is used to cool the finished steel sheets. 
The drainage duct lies beyond that. Head for that drainage duct. Okay, so there's a drainage duct we're heading to. That is to the north. Maybe that's where our objective point is. Careful, Snake. This place is crawling with gecko and dwarf gecko. It must have been Vamp who sealed the blast furnace door. How do you figure? No one ever comes down here, and yet there's gecko everywhere. He must have figured if I couldn't get the door open, I'd come down here. That freak set up a kill zone just for me. Figures. Snake, don't let him get to you. You've got to get through there alive. Somehow, I don't know how. This one we're gonna get Gecko spotted. I don't know how we can. Designed for high mobility, even in cramped urban environments like this one. Yeah, you're telling me. Their legs' main drive uses artificial muscle tissue, genetically engineered from the cloned ES cells of ungulate embryos. This what? gives them quick response times and a high output to weight ratio. Basically, the gecko have the legs of a star athlete. That's what makes them so agile. But it's also their weak point. Those things may have an amazingly high output, but they're also deployed in limited indoor search and destroy operations. So there's a limit to how heavy they can make the frames. Otherwise, they'd drop right through the floor. To keep its weight down, the gecko's defensive armor is concentrated on the head. Where the central computer is housed. Okay. The legs aren't defenseless, but by comparison, they're a pretty soft target. In other words, shoot the targeting legs. their legs should at least slow them down, right? Exactly. Keep it in mind. It could save your life. Sounds like we're gonna be trying to gun it through this anyway. And that go that gecko up there, we gotta shoot its legs. Shoot the legs. Hey Snake, something I've been meaning to ask you. Yeah. That canyon. Isn't that where you demolished Raven's tank? How'd you do it, anyway? Grenades. How? Uh, well, grenades. That's it? That's it. You didn't use an anti-tank missile I or something? I had a pistol, so I figured did grenades I was a one? better idea. Your technique is kind of... Well, how do I put this? Archaic when it comes to fighting tanks. Honestly, I don't think it'd work on today's main battle tanks. Well, that's how I did it. What do you want me to say? You know... I asked an active duty army officer once, if an infantryman had to take on a tank one-on-one, -on -one, how should he do it? And what was his answer? Grenades. Don't. Oh. <laughs> he swore there's no way in hell a single infantryman could take down a tank by himself. Huh. Interesting. I always suspected there was a little something crazy about you, Snake. But hearing that story, now I know it. You're nuts. Single-handedly taking out a tank? That's crazy. You're insane. Oh, You're God, insane. is this your idea of a compliment? Yes. You're the toughest, craziest, most hardcore badass on the planet. You're the shit. <laughs> I love how he just like, couldn't put anything to words there. When you fought Liquid's Hind D on the comm tower, there was a nasty blizzard back then, too. Mm-hmm. That was a tough scrape. But you still managed to shoot down his gunship. Yeah. Up till then, I'd heard that even with a man pads, going one on one against an attack chopper was an act of suicide. I thought only Hollywood action stars did that kind of thing. But you made it look easy. It wasn't. I just told you, it wasn't that easy. Really? But you were all like, oh, I had to take out that helicopter. Real cool. Oh, like, I had to take out the helicopter. Like it was nothing. He did All say right, it like enough that. Chit -chat. Let's get going. We got a long way to go to Rex's hangar. Yeah, you're right, Snake. Poor poor Snake can barely even talk. We're getting a lot of great conversations without Otacon. Keep moving north through the rolling facility. The door to the drainage duct leading to Rex's hangar is at the north end. So that one's directions, which more than likely means that's all he's gonna give us. There is a second gecko over there. This is really my only strategy. Champ out the little guys. And run for it when he's not looking. I don't see any point of going over there, but there's... There's really other levels? Like, can I walk up there? Oh, that was another entrance to the same room. Hmm. So I guess good thing we went to the right. But the problem is that Gecko is gonna pounce on... He's gonna pounce on us. Unless I shot the legs. Can I shoot them now? You know what? 
Freaking got it! Freaking got it! Oh no. Is this our only way through? Oh, son of a biscuit! Joey! Go, go, wait, wait. Okay, going through here. Go down, 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 down. Oh my gosh, look at our health. I don't even know what hit us. Okay, um. Uh. Get up, get up, get up. We gotta heal. We gotta heal. We gotta heal. In our strength. Okay, because if I'm remembering correctly, that's the door. That's the door! We did it! Okay, that's the door, and that's our objective point, which means we have no idea what's on the other side of that door. And knowing how Metal Gear works, guys. Uh, uh, we need health badly. Things might get really bad on the other side of that door. You know what, um, laying down, I think, recovers your health faster. 85% camo. I am pretty well disguised. Bet if I put my mask on, I'd be a whole 99 right now. Alright, let's fill her up. We're gonna get in this next room. Since we're waiting, let's not use that at all. Let's actually switch these up. Um, aside from that, I think we're alright. I mean, I can reload this while I'm waiting here. Oh my gosh, that room. How do you do that with no alerts? How? I mean, does a caution count as an alert? I've been thinking of that because people play these games um, trying to get the I think it's called the, the big boss trophy at the end, or you know how we get grades at uh, how well we were playing the game in the um, other games. You know, like I got a shark in the last one, and um, elephant in the first two. I don't really know what they mean. I'm sure they're grading how well you're fighting. Oh gosh. Something isn't right here. Something isn't right here. Are we there? Are we there? Finally. It's just up ahead. The hangar's just a little bit further. Oh no. Stay on route. Oh my. You are a snake which was not created. That was the end of the Vulcan Raven fight. You and the boss, you are from another world. A world that I do not wish to know. I love that fight. Snake, in the natural world, there is no such thing as boundless slaughter. There is always an end to it, but you are different. The path you walk on has no end. The killing will never end. It's a future without hope. You hear me, right. Snake. My spirit will be watching you. Ironically, as the place is full of ravens. Yo! Oh, those are holes. I remember this place used to be full of trap holes and everything. I wonder if there's goodies up there. Oh, we shouldn't risk it. We shouldn't risk it. Rex is on the floor above you. Use the lift. Oh. We're in the room with it, aren't we? No, this is where it started. Oh, this was where it all started. By it started, I mean the final boss. I remember when I walked into this room, my jaw just hit the floor. I was just like... <gasps> And here's the third version of the Metal Gear. The only difference from him and two is, I think, the color. Yeah, it was right here. Hop on, Snake. I'll send her up. Yay, thanks, Otacon. Wait, send her up? All right. Right when, uh, we... We're on there, the elevator was taking us up, and that's where the battlefield is. I've got a bad feeling. Do we have to fight it again? Do they have the Rex ready? They said they did. Yup. Scared. 
Very much scared. Okay. 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 Of all the PTSD in this game, this part is really scaring me because this boss fight was so hard. Oh my gosh. It was probably... Probably the hardest fight in the series. So far, I think. I kind of think so. That final boss of the first game was insane. Like, I actually beat the final boss of two on my second try. Rex. Rex took forever. Even Snake's jaw dropped there. Uh. Oh, it's still here. Look, the railgun's been removed. Oh! They Liquid didn't need Rex. Rex to launch his nuke. He only needs the railgun. Uh oh. Damn it. They He's already, already beat us. Shipped. Hang on, I'll check. I'm afraid so. Unfortunately for you, the railgun is no longer here. Was she just sneaking her way into his night? Naomi. This place will be your grave. But Naomi. As my queen wishes. The suicide gecko are on their way. Oh. Soon, there'll be nothing left of this place. We've been had. On a gun. Snake, I think I might be able to get it working. I just need some time. Get Hurry. It's working? That thing? I'll leave the rest to you. Can I rocket launch it? Naomi. Now. Oh no, you're kidding. Excellent. You're joking, right? You'll amuse me until they arrive. You're kidding, right? Come on. I just held down the R button just so we can get a pause. Um. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'll take care of Rex. You take Sam. Kill that monster. Get Naomi back, Snake. Please. You asked for quite a lot there, man. Oh. 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 oh gosh. Oh. We're even right now. Um. What? You just dodged a sniper bullet. Um. I tried to dodge past him. It didn't work. Whoa! Whoa! Uh oh! Uh oh! I forgot about his knives! Reload these. Okay, they're easy enough to dodge. Oh. He's not taking much damage. Oh, he doesn't even care! I'm unloading on him! Unfortunately, I should really be hitting him with something harder. Oh! Oh, he was just right there. He could have had me. He just freaking charges you! Okay, I need something else. I need another plan. Where'd he go? Whoa! Oh! Got you! Close range! Got you again! Hmm... I think we can do it with this, though. No, no. Yes! Oh, my health is not doing so good. I got my rations up, though. I'll be okay. He's not so bad, though. Oh! Is this your best? Your oh, best. God! Is, this your best? is that fair? 
It's not even fair. Uh oh. Okay. Oh. Give me those back. These are powerful as crap. What the? Mm. I haven't shot one. Yes. Uh oh. And dodge him. Okay. Get this back. Oh. Ow. Oh, come on. Is this your best? Oh. Is that even fair? Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. He's so hard. Oh, let's eat again, another one. Uh, uh, was the regain a better idea? Restores um, life and psyche when consumed. Um, I don't know what the difference is. Oh, they're better. Regains are better. Oh, no. Oh gosh, get away, get away, get away, get away. What? Did I not get him? Did I not get him? We need new weapons. We need new weapons. I could shoot him with a railgun. Is that too, that's too powerful. I think it's a waste. We still have plenty of these. I think we're doing okay with what we got. We just gotta reload. Ah. Oh! No, no, no. Oh my god. That one's circling me! That doesn't even make any sense! Gimme these, gimme these, gimme these, gimme these. Okay, we're working them down. Alright. Come on, how can you survive all those? Do they need to be headshots? Come on. I don't even know if I'm doing anything. I don't think I am. Come on back here. What? Did I not get him? Oh, he lost me. You can lose him. Can you dodge all of these yeah. shots that I'm about to... These? Ooh. Come on, you're so close. Come on. Ooh. This is close. Oh. How are you alive? Isn't that always the question with Vamp? Nope. Yes. No. Time to finish this. What do I do then? Oh! Oh my gosh! I have to lose him. I need better weapons. Dodge cool! Ah! I thought I dodged him! Do I have to kill him a certain way? Whoa! I don't trust you! Yes! It's no, it's no use! He keeps regenerating! What do we do? What do we do? Good question! Ah! That's not my codec. Oh, I'm about to get kicked in the back. Otacon, help me. Make him pay, Snake. Do it for me. For Emma. That's not helpful. Do whatever it takes. Just make sure he stays down this time. Get Naomi back for me, please. Damn it. 
It looks like conventional attacks won't be enough after all. Yeah. If only we had a bomb. Turn him into a cloud of pink smoke. Snake, there's only one option left. Find some way to stop his nano machines from working. It could be the silver bullet we're looking for. But how? The syringe? Think, Snake. There must be a way. The syringe? Do I have to do it when he's down? Damn it. It looks like. Con it's the syringe. We need to hit him with the syringe when he's down. Snake, I don't know much about Vamp, so there's not much I can offer you by way of advice. But you do have my unconditional support. Don't let him beat you, Snake. Thanks, Rose. You're just as helpful as you were in the last game. Oh! This is oh, oh, okay. Got a plan this time. Got a plan. Coming this way. I see you. I know what to do. I know what to do. Come on. You coming for me? I got plenty of shots with your name on them. See, every little one of them says, Vampy Poo, I miss you so much! Be my friend, Vampy Poo! And... I got him with some of those. He just takes forever. Uh oh. That's not good. Snake is too slow. Snake's too slow. Snake's too slow. Snake's too slow. No! He missed. He missed. And. It's down! Come on, come on back out. Okay, now, um, 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 it's an item, right? Yes, I have it equipped, it actually. Okay, let's try this. Um, how do you use it? Okay, I only use it on myself. To so use it on others, capture them using CQC, then press the uh, the triangle. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying! That's it. Um... Yes! Ah! Yes! Oh, that worked! Oh. What have you done? There. Now you're a mere mortal, like the rest of us. Never. But can you kill this mere mortal? I hope that was enough. Are you joking me? Fight. How about it, undying man? Care to die too? Sorry, but I can't die just yet. Then kill me. <sighs> Snake, this one is mine. You keep those gecko at bay. <gasps> Fighting the gecko with the railgun? Paragon, we're gonna buy you some time. I'll do my best. 
Oh. I remember having my own little fist fight up there. You are a scout too, are you not? A scout. Well, let us do with blades. It's his dick knife. So, let me put down my weapon and then fight with a smaller one because you don't have a bigger weapon. Does that make any sense, Raiden? Maybe we're gonna cutscene our way through this enough. Snakes, we don't actually have to fight those things. Real Genny should be able to do this. Just don't go into gameplay. They are. They are. Oh! It's like a split screen. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, you see those X's? Those are blocked areas. I'm trapped in here, and I have to fight them off. Oh my gosh, this is really intense. But it's already been kind of a long episode, and we should save this for next time. So thank you all so much for watching, remember to like the videos and subscribe for more, and I will see you all in the next episode of Metal Gear Solid 4. See you!